New year, same agenda. Congress must pass government spending bills or face a shutdown this month, and there seems to be some movement. On Sunday, House and Senate leaders announced an agreement on government funding. The total price? More than $1.5 trillion, a number in line with a prior agreement between President Biden and then-Speaker Kevin McCarthy, a sign of how long these negotiations have stalled out. Republicans have wanted to cut federal spending, which this package keeps in place much of the non-defense spending Democrats wanted. Speaker of the House Mike Johnson says there are some Republican victories, including a $10 billion cut to IRS funding, as well as a $6 billion clawback in COVID-19 relief funding. Now it is unclear whether this year's agreement will get the support needed to pass to avert a partial shutdown coming in less than two weeks. Congress faces a first deadline of January 19th to pass four individual spending bills to avoid a shutdown, then a second deadline of February 2nd to pass another eight bills.